What is up, all you sexy nerds? Grizzly McBee here. And it has been a while since I've done a Nerd Chronicles. Um, been a lot of stuff going on in life. Uh, as you know, Wild's been going through some things. I've been going through some things. Had some med medical issues that I've dealt with and that I'm still dealing with. Um, and, and because of that, things are kind of going a bit slower than we would like with the project. I'm not sure if Wild has mentioned it yet or not, um, but we're going to be pushing back our next season of our podcast due to life, as it were, right now. Uh, with everything going on with, with me and my life, everything going on with Wild and his life, um, everything going on with Monster and his... Uh, we're just kind of pushing things back a little bit to where we can kind of figure out where we want to jump into and when we have time to be able to get things rolling again. Um, but with that being said, we will be coming back with more podcasts. There will be a season nine. Um, we'll be getting it going. It's just going to take a little bit of time. So what have I been up to? Uh, like I said, I had some medical issues. Um, had a surgery, almost had a second surgery. In case you guys aren't aware, it's uh, finally winter in California, which means it's getting fucking cold. Um, yeah, it sucks. Uh, we don't like the heat in California, but we definitely don't like the cold in California. You know, I've just been doing my, my gaming thing. Um, Wild and I finally finished The Forest. Uh, it's what, I believe his second or third time that he's beaten The Forest. My first time finally beating the forest since we started five-ish, six-ish years ago when we first started the forest. Um, and I know that those videos will be uh, coming out in the near future. Uh, so you'll be able to see the awesome things that we did in that. Um, I know that uh, we're playing a lot of other games. We're playing Gen Generation Zero. We're playing that again um, now that they've updated it and there's an actual storyline to it and there's actually NPCs to the game. Completely changes the game 180. And uh, we're, we're getting back into that and we're liking that again. So uh, other things that are going on in my life um, that I know wild and the crew know about but you as our viewers our our extended nerd family uh don't know about is uh i'm single uh, things just didn't work out we went our separate ways um and now i have new roommates uh it's a younger couple that i work with and um one of them uh christian he is a gamer like us. He's a younger cat, but he's cool as hell. He's been playing a lot with Wild and myself. Um, he jumped in with us with the forest. He was one of the main reasons why we got to move through the forest and actually get it done. Um, we've been playing, we're playing Generation Zero with him uh, because he has never beaten the game. So we're kind of escorting him along through that game which is different for me because usually I'm the one that hasn't beaten the game and they're escorting me now it's the other way around so it, it feels good it feels good it's like I'm I'm taking my son and my younger brother on a journey and we're having fun uh, let's see other games that we're playing we're playing The Division there's so many great games that have come out recently on the Playstation that we're just so excited for um, one that I'm excited for that finally came out on PlayStation that I've got and that I will hopefully be streaming here in the near future. Uh, won't be from start to finish because it's uh, impossible to finish this game. Um, is called The Hunter, Call of the Wild. Now, for those of you that have been watching for a long time and listening, I refer to myself as a country nerd. You know, I'm an outdoorsy guy, I like hunting, I like fishing, I like camping, everything outdoors, but I also like my games. And Hunter Call of the Wild is a hunting game. Um, hunting big game, birds, 
uh, tracking them down. So I will hopefully in the future be uh, streaming some of that on our Twitch channel. Uh, Wild and I started playing Shadow Warriors 2, which is a freaking awesome game. I'm loving it. Just started. We've only played for a couple hours, but it's it's a good game. I know another game that we're wanting to continue on with our survival-esque uh, gameplay is a game that uh, Wild and I have been talking about wanting to do for a while, and Christian is actually very good at it, is Ark. We're talking about possibly getting back into that and um, streaming that and tr trying to make a series out of that. So that's one thing that we're wanting to do. And then there's a game that rumor has it may be coming to the PlayStation, which Wild and I for years have been waiting for it to come to the PlayStation. And Christian and I actually talked today um, and he said as soon as it comes out that's the only thing we're going to be playing and that is raft um as soon as that comes to playstation expect streams and and multiple episodes of gameplay on on that thing um another thing that that uh not just myself but the rest of the crew are, are kind of uh quite interested in is uh discord is finally going to be coming to the playstation so I won't have to hold my phone anymore. I'll be able to use my PlayStation Eye. And uh, we'll be able to Discord from the PlayStation, which would be freaking awesome. You can't hear him, but Wild's here. He's just muted. Um, he's here to remind me of things that I forget, you know, getting old. I know with a lot of games that we've done over the years, um, I've lagged like crazy. Uh, whether it be from where I'm living to the shitty internet that I've got, that is no longer the case. I have bitchin' internet now. Well, said it's 30 times better than anything I've ever had, and he is quite wrong. If math serves me right, which it always does, it's a thousand times better than I've ever had. Yeah, I've just been loving the PlayStation Plus. Another thing that Wild and I are wanting to do here in the near future is um, we're going to get on a Hasbro kick. We're going to play some Uno. We're going to play some Monopoly. We're going to play some oh hell, Risk, Battleship. We're going to play uh, uh, Wheel of Fortune. We're, Trivial Pursuit. You name it, we're going to play it. Because that's content in itself. Because games like that, it, it just pretty much writes itself. And we don't write it. Another thing that I'm super excited about is the the PlayStation levels, if you will. So the first stage is this, the essential. That's what everybody starts out at. And it's got just your regular PlayStation Plus stuff. And then there's the PlayStation Extra, which gives you a little bit more games to choose from um, that you get for free, yada, yada. But then there's the premium, which the premium is 120 bucks a year. So twice as much as... as the regular essential but it is so worth it since getting the premium i've downloaded probably six hundred dollars worth of games for free yeah and, and keep in mind we are not sponsored by playstation in the slightest but we are very happy with their new products yeah it's it's well worth the extra sixty dollars a year for the premium because there's not only a ton of games that you get for free that you can download for free but there's like the game bundles that comes with all the DLCs for free uh, there's like the classic games that you can stream through the cloud that you don't even have to download but you can still play for free and it's it's like GameStop but a million times better better than GameStop. So yeah, uh, PlayStation Premium. Monster and I do still need to get together and do the next challenge. There may be another challenge. 
myself against a uh, a new youngcomer that is not part of the not part of the crew, but games with us. He does not know about this challenge, but he was there when said Japanese spicy noodles were bought. So Christian, this challenge goes out to you, my friend. Spicy noodles at dawn. Pussy. You will lose, and I will shit blood, but it will be worth it. Holiday season's upon us. Christmas right around the corner. Um, well, for those of you out there in the, the nerd family world, uh, happy holidays. Uh, drink responsibly. Have a good time. Enjoy the company that you got. But you don't know how long it's going to be there. And with that being said, stay nerdy and stay sexy. Always. Until next time.